wouldn't be a stream without some technical issues. Um, some reason my controls aren't working. And I'm hoping it's capturing the game, but it's not showing the game capture either. What's going on today? Um, so, trying to quickly get stuff working. Otherwise, this is going to be a very short uh, stream. Still refuses. What is going on? trying to first get one uh, sorted, then I can go over to the next, and yeah, stuff is not working, stuff that was working. That is working, it sounds correct, but not working. Chess is fine. <sighs> Gotta love it. Okay, that's not really helping. And why is it not capturing the game? Apparently it's got the game sound. If I look at the peak power meters. Um, why is everything breaking today? Microsoft released a patch or something that I don't know about that's screwed up everything now or oh, what's going on?
game capture is not working. It took it a while to capture, but my controls aren't working. So yeah, there's always something. Overlord underscore the underscore of Ali is now following. Uh, thanks for the follow. While well, I try and figure out what's going on. Um, that's all working. At least, okay, I'll try and figure out that part. My controls out later. Okay. Searching for the witch Siri had quarreled with, Geralt ran into an old friend, Kira Metz. Sorceress told the Witcher about a masked mage. Siri had seemed to take him shelter in his hideout. The Witcher set off to find him, with Kira in tow. Siri had never reached the Elven Mage, yet the Wild Hunt had. The ghostly retinue was one step ahead of Geralt, or so it seemed. The Witcher felt it always lost, until Kira gave him a new lead. The crones have put back Bob. Which wants us to go and kill a monster. And my equipment needs repairs. So, first things first, um, we need to go to the way shrine. Which is just outside the city, and then quick travel to where we can just repair our armor and case and sorters, where we can repair our armor and sword. So we need a blacksmith, and I know there's a blacksmith here. Well, apparently, there's a blacksmith there also. Um, so let's go to here. I think it's going to be quick now. So yeah, right on the other side of town. But luckily, it's not a big town. Um, and this storage here. Oh, it's just merchant. A blacksmith that's walking away. Yeah? Craft special order weapons too? Do politicians murder high class prostitutes? Of course. And we've got a nice tree in our way. Um, I'll take a look. Maybe pick something. So, our silver swords need repair. Um. I went to a blacksmith. One thing that's starting to get annoying is them trying to tell us um, the whole time uh, the hints. So, other stuff we've got, just looking through if something is better. So we've got hunting boots, which is better, so let's put that on. Uh, well, I don't want to repair it, I want to swap it, okay, I can't swap it. Okay, for now, uh, repair equip stuff. So that should repair all our stuff. Um, Hunting boots I want to keep. That's just a repair kit. Field repair kit. Um, so let's just sell all of the other stuff that we don't need. That's the hunting boots. That's the other hunting boots, and we want those ones. And then wild 
Time to sort. Um, still sort. Sort. Um, going to get rid of that. So we're just quickly scanning through. So. So we want that gone, that we can sell, that we can sell. Okay. Um, so long. So we've got better boots. Um, yeah, this is a big smash of slowing. So one thing that I like about ESO is you can actually um, make your character look like something. I'm doing okay, uh, Overlord. Um, just trying to do these missions again. Um, took a bit of a time off, didn't feel so well yesterday, but feeling better today. So, we have to give this guy the, the village the knife, and then he's going to give us who we are, what Greetings. we need to kill. What's bothering the villagers? Nice village. Aye, a real pearl of the swamps, if you say so. You get by all right? Aye, winter to winter. Somehow we survive. Recognize this dagger? Aye, master. I didn't know you belonged to them. Uh, glad to understand each other. I don't belong to anyone. Don't belong to anyone. Down to business. I want to get this done quickly. Ah, so that's how it's to be. I'm supposed to help solve your problem. Tell me what it is. Just the essentials. The war awoke an ancient power. An evil one that feeds on bloodshed. Nightmares haunt our nights and days. Folks sleepwalk from their homes, never to return. Under the tree on the Whispering Hillock they lie. Unburied all. Fathers, sons, daughters, and mothers. Folk are afeard to move them. You must go there. The dark powers must be cast off. Uh, more detail. Need more details. You must see for yourself. Me grand's mum whacked me crosswise for straying near the Whispering Hillock. But what happens there now is a wonder. A few times folk from round here gathered to chop down the trees and burn the cursed soil back to use. None returned. The ground neath the weeds is white with human bones. How long has it been like this? When did all this start? Three year back. I remember, it was a warm day, went to check the snares for game. I pulled the hair from me trap. It grew dark all of a sudden, though it was nigh on noontime. Thought it was a storm at first. A squeal pierced the air, near burst me ears. The hair rotted in me hands. And the leaves shriveled and yellowed, though it were yet the start of summer. Times have been ill ever since. Folks' teeth turn black as charcoal. Women folk fight like polecats, bawling and brawling over nothing. The young'uns... Born crippled, lame, fear and cursing. Long have we pled for the lady's help. I'll look around. Ladies of the wood don't know what this power is. They know all. Old Thecla claimed they'd be punishing us. Folks stop respecting them. Some even call them witches. But must not be they, for they sent you. 
I look around the whispering hillock. You be careful, Master Witcher. Don't ye treat this evil light. Okay. So we need to go and look at the willow. Um, which is down here. So let's go uh, get cockroach. Where is cockroach? Ah, there's cockroach. What the hell did it just do? What? Get into a fighting stance, idiot! going to die. <laughs> yeah, it's been a w couple of days that uh, Griffinette has been on that saddle. You'd also think bandits would think twice of attacking somebody that's riding around with a griffin head on the saddle. And the worst is that should have been such an easy run, Roach. Um, attack. But, uh, because initially it went into them, uh, I don't know, trying to interact with them or ask them for the way or, I don't know. Don't let him catch his breath! As a bunch, lad! What do you think? It's a witcher. I hate arrows. Get this guy because he's going for bolts again. Where are you? Oh, damn it, we've got company. <sighs> Lovely. Spells right. Damn it, didn't get my spells right. And I we went too close to the river, so I got more monsters. Uh, 
Now it'll probably reset me back before the bandits again. So I have to fight all the bandits all over again. Yeah, now I didn't know there was monsters in the river, so I didn't think about looking at the river. But yeah, it's, I knew there was monsters there. I probably was on the mini map showing that there was monsters, but I didn't see it. I have to do the bands one more time, otherwise I'm just going to ride around there. full gallop. Then we don't need to deal with the monsters. Yeah, that's me re uh, greeting and driving. <laughs> uh, but yeah, yeah uh, lots of times you can just bypass them by just going through the woods or Be something. Gone. Come you no closer. Yeah. I know whence you come. Sounds like an invitation. Wolf. The powers that protect me, they sense whence you come. fighting stance. Power of protection. Okay. So we're right in the middle of that circle. Found at what? Killing the demons under the hill using the witcher sense. Huh? So patch it under the. Concentrating on my spells, which I can't spell uh, cast yet. So let's do this again. It's 
come out of your damn stun. Because apparently blocking does not do anything. He's healing up. And there goes my shields again. Damage to it. Um. He's healing faster than I'm doing damage. I got his health down and then he starts going up again. So he's actually healing. <sighs> Where is my blessing? Be gone. Okay. Come a no closer. I know whence you come. Not so fast, Roach. Move it. The powers that protect me, they sense whence you come. Okay. So we'll have to kill the wolves all over again. the tree and there is more wolves around This way, there's the werewolf. And the question is, how do we take care of that werewolf? Be gone! Be gone! Be gone! The powers will not relent. What's that yellow glow there? to roll twice. I'm trying to go faster this time around because it's apparent that he is healing quicker. Maybe shields isn't a good one for this one. We need fire. And then 
was busy doing something there. He's healing up again. Ah. He's healing too quickly. Uh, but it's obvious that I need to use fire on him. So I need to switch my spells from... I wonder... Uh, so fire is effective against him, but if I uh, stun him, um, why do I always struggle with that? Uh, if I use that, what will it do? Be gone! Be gone! Be gone. No, it's not working. Switching back. That must be. That was a mistake, apparently. Okay, that's not working. He heals very quickly and powers up. I need to keep him stunned uh, from doing that. Um, mind control doesn't work. Uh, well, not effectively, because the moment I hit him, he. He's immediately back. Uh, magic trap is only so good. So Ignis, I only want to go with. Be gone! Be gone! Be gone! The powers will not I didn't even land one single blow on him just like that time. That was even worse than all of the other attempts. Uh, I think I'm getting worse. Alternative is uh, uh, we need to basically create uh, an oil files um, sort. Well, apparently I can only create one oil. So, now I've got that oil. And now my silver sword is oiled. And make sure I'm on Igni. Be gone! Be gone! The powers of the not relent! And that didn't go well.
What is happening? It's powering up again. Can I make the tree invisible? And he's nearly at full health again. How must I defeat a creature that keeps on healing faster than I can damage him? And my health is not keeping up. And I can't block because block literally then I stun me. I'm level five and be gone. Be gone. it's level be eight, gone. that's why I'm struggling so much. The power is not really place of power. Let me just go around him. Uh. Okay, that's abilities. So let's see what we can do. So I'm level six and that's level eight character. Um, fast attacks, next level, fast attacks, Greenland point fifteen. Uh, we still have the blue on our side, so explosive shield, sustaining lifts. Igni sign deals effect. So I'm going to put it into Igni. Um, so now Ig Ah, wrong button. So Igni is now level two. And I want muscle men also. So now Igneous level 2. So I should do more damage now. So back to Igni. Ah, oh, damn it. That was. He's dodging also. This is a high level character uh, monster for me, at least. Uh, it's two levels above my level. The problem is, I need. Uh, I can do side missions to try and up my abilities, and I'll probably have lost all this, the stuff that I did. Um, yeah, my sword's no longer enchanted. Alchemy. So we need to craft this again. Go to here. And the oils on my sword. Be gone. Be gone. 
Show me what you got. Be gone. see what we can do. Um, going back up, because I want to go to that, to this side. of rocks and then a drop down. This invisible wall. Really? And then a clip face. Ah, we speak the boss. Sweet. So, going back into our inventory. Craft the oil. So we thought. Do we have anything that's going to help us? character um, we didn't get that point do we lost now that point uh, okay be gone be gone be gone the powers will not relent not good <laughs> need to roll past him. <laughs> so how must I get past this guy? Basically go and do other missions to build up my abilities. Front matter is this guy really to do with the tree? So I can wonder slash hope that it isn't. So let's see if we can go back around. For a
Because that is down there. This is outside this yellow ground. sign here also. I'm not seeing anything else. Find a place under the hill using your witcher sense. Uh, only thing that's lighting up is this. I don't see a passageway there. There's only a cliff face of the werewolf there. There's a red sign. Something. Even the women weren't spared. So there was something around. I'm picking it up again. So there's a werewolf there. And the markers show that direction, the trail. Shows also passed away wolf. Be gone. Be gone. Be gone. Medallion's humming. The powers will not be power. It's gotta be. Oh, there's something. Showing something here. <gasps> yeah. So we don't need to do the werewolf. that way but we can't directly go there and I can't use maps here so we have to swim apparently Why have you come? Why 
Feel this blood. Are you here to grant me death? Or is my freedom your wish? Why was attacked? Who are you? Let's start with the simple question. Who are you? I abandoned my circle. Where I kept the balance. The crones killed me. And cursed my ghost. Never heard of a druid circle in Bevan. I wander eternally through a maze of vows. Helplessly sliding or rustling. Why did they kill you? What do you know about the crones? You must know the crones pretty well. They are felons curse. They hear all through seven years. They weave hair and twist lives. They take their strength from the broth of human flesh. Oh, but that's why we uh, found so many skeletons in the lair. Why did they kill you? Why did they kill you? The crones want this land. They drew the wood alone. I stood in their way. I had to die. Why was I attacked? I was attacked. This is my prison. A fortress besieged. Murderers I await. And my forest protects me. Murderers? Murderous sisters. Killed my body. Now my soul they hunt, for I defy them. Okay. You know, what are victims? I saw women, children, lying dead on this hill. Did they want to destroy you? To nature, to the forest and earth, all death is alive. Every death is equal. I cry. I will. No, no, this Okay. You claim I can free you. You claim to be imprisoned. How so? I am bound here in fetters of magic. I wandered endlessly. A labyrinth of these. The children. I know all. I know what to bring this them. Free me, please. I must help. If something threatens the orphans, I'll help them myself. The children have been taken. Free me, please. I can be a girl. A gallop unchained. I shall see them. Only I can. I don't believe you. I've got to think this over. Clearing are in danger. Let's hear what he says about that. Why do you think the kids from the meadow are in danger? The sisters took them. They shall not return. Where'd they take them? They can help. It is done already. It cannot be undone. There are no rules to art ceremony. They shall all die. Let them be saved. Uh, we already had that. Gotta think this over. I don't believe you. Let's help him. If you can save the orphans from the meadow, I'll help you. I will find them. Free them. Open the door of my cage. Blood is my escape. A rite you must perform. With the black of raven feathers. The white of my boots, and the swift steed, a bear wild and free, in meadows pasture caught, dark as a bottomless well, black as the depths of night, such a beast, no other, gather these, and bring them here. Feather. Got some raven feathers. Find my remains and bring me a mount. A wind born steed, a black squall turned horse. Horse? Why do we need a black horse? The beast and I shall be as one. As when. 
when I live, we shall be a gale. Nothing to stop us. A wild steed from meadows moist. And your remains. Where will I find your remains? My bones. They lie in a solitary mound. Nearby. Due west. back once I have everything. I'll gather what I need to free you, then return. Gather and return to the hillock's depths, to the tree's rotten heart. Pierce my heart. Let blood flow to be born again. I must first be consumed. Go now and return through the passage I have opened. Okay, that leaves a lot of possibilities. So, place of power should draw from it. Where's the wheels? Okay, find the bones. Um, So yeah, um, that way we'll apparently just skimp around and uh, it'll disappear. So now to get the bugs, which is probably going to be protected. Come on. when she jumps out of the water. Don't land! Damn it! <laughs> Knew my life, uh, my health was low, but thought I could get it done. So, let's try this again. Come on. and jumped out of this ledge. I want to 
deliberately taking an alternative route, trying to miss most of the monsters. Oh, yeah, didn't really drop anything. Oh well. As far as I know, it's close. So I should be able to just run there. Which is, of course, is got it. Yes, <laughs> like I don't think I've landed one single shot there. Apparently a mat is dangerous. I can't really bypass those monsters. Apparently I can do this. Get uh, uh, off the la land, off the water. Damn it. Why am I so struggling with this? Hitting, landing a blow. And that's partly why I'm struggling so much. It's step one in defeating a foe land blows. Apparently I'm struggling on that. And we're back here. Oh, lovely. Let's get out. Let's see if we can at least um, do a quick save at that location. What's wrong? Um, quick save at that location so that we don't need to the whole time um, run this whole path to get there. So, just not 
here. Do a quick save here. Where is she? She's there. Come out, come out. The water. up now. At least she's not like the come now. I'm trying to get my shields up. Get the shields up. I just like kind of First thing she does, she eats my shields off. Every time, when I get close to her, she eats my shields out. Uh, get my shields uh, correctly up. Really? from my shields. I need to rest up also. There's nothing else here. Karma Wild was using Axie sign. Not exactly what I was planning. Uh, so, next is a Wild Horse. And he said he has Black Raven feathers. Faster. Oh, uh, up here. Get here. Where does he want to? Whoa, there, Roach. Where does he want me to go? Because apparently, this GPS does not work. Move it.
Okay, so now I need to find a wild horse. Not so fast, Roach. Slow now. Whoa. How big is this area? Well, we're right in the middle of it. this horse. I saw something here, but it could be a buck. Okay, we're going outside the area. And I'm chasing a world. That wasn't too difficult. Not to get back. Yeah, luckily the, this wasn't created by a real GPS company. This map thing. I swear, more there would be more cars driving into rivers. Guess we need Gideon. to go down and around. <coughs> so it's stuck on a tree limb. Let's go. Ready. We can start. Let me fly. Lay wings amidst the feathers. Place all beneath my heart. My heart, you must pierce and break the steed. to being in the tree and destroy it. Actually, I'm going to kill you. I found human remains. Well, what did we expect to find? Human remains. Saw bodies of women and children in the woods. You've killed people who are no threat to you. The wood killed them, for nature is blind. Death is never more than death. Basically, destroy. Um, I'm gonna kill you. Trick the being. Let's just start the ritual. Let's. So I'm feeling something I weird. Raven but feathers. Once I was free, I shall be free once more. I, I offer your remains. 
Once I was flesh, I shall be flesh once more. Attacks. So. Free the children. I shall. Yeah, Black Beauty. <laughs> nice name. Okay, so now we need to tell the elder man of uh, they took care of the problem. Medallion's humming. Place of power, it's gotta be. Okay, let's see if we can use power again. I basically lost that uh, point, skill point. So we want to talk to the older man. Solved your problem. Just in case, though, avoid the whispering hillock for a while. Cannot be. Where's something lurking there? Spirit had possessed the tree, destroyed something, not sure what. You don't want to know. Let's get a go with number three. Believe me, you don't want to know. What have you done? I freed the evil spirit, it doesn't matter. Well, what's the spirit evil? Went up the hill, took care of the problem. The details are my concern. I truly said. I knows naught of such things anyway. The crones, or the ladies of the wood as you call them, said to remind you about payment. Take it you know what they want? Aye, I do. Give me the dagger. Be back soon. I've got a feeling right now. Somebody's going to be missing ears. him. There is payment. Take it to the ladies, will you? What the hell was that? Tis our pact. Uh, you're a stranger. You don't know life here. It's honest pay for their protection. So, all those ears in the woods... Put it out your mind, master. You soon be leaving and we must tarry on. Our young'uns and their young'uns after them. No gods nor masters watch over Velen. The land is no man's. He who wants to survive must seek his own protectors. Yeah. They want ears. Just they listen and spy with ears. Just as the tree said. Young man. In real life, you're different than you were in the tapestry. Well, bring it here. Why did I treat that old woman? I don't trust him.
you disobeyed us once more. We are forgiving creatures, but you, you allowed the children to escape. They never wanted to flee. They liked it here. They played. Your punishment must be harsh. Now silence! We must speak to the white-haired one. I know that, Mark. This is Anna, the wife of the Baron of Crow's Perch. She belongs to no man. A fruit ripened in her womb. A fruit sprouted from seed sown by a man she detested. We helped her. She agreed to serve. She bears the mark. She is ours. Come. Okay. It is another woman who interests you. Speak, white-haired one. Uh. You look different now. Tell me about the doom when I seek. Our deal. I did my part, now you do yours. A word once given, we never break. The girl. Mousy blonde. That's what they call it. Thin as a rail. Terrified. Exhausted. She could barely stun the poor thing. We cared for her as best we could. Like she was our own daughter. Wasted affection. She proved a very naughty girl. Mischievous, stubborn, and selfish. Where is she now? Don't believe you. They say you always keep your word. So tell me everything, exactly as it happened. We shall tell you, brave boy. We knew someone suffered the life. We read the beast in trails, saw the omens. We would glimpse her likeness, a mirage in a puddle. She came from the lower swamp. We knew not at first it was her the omens had spoken of. A child of the elder blood. The soul seed that would burst into flame. She fell into our hands. The blood! Mm, the blood of the traitress. Does she sleep? Like a lamb. Come, sisters, no point in dawdling. The table's set. The cauldron bubbles. We cannot! You know she is meant for him! Inlet will get her. He will. But not whole. <laughs> well said. We'll just have a sample. I'll take her feet. Lovely. And plump. Perfect for a broth. Oh, I can taste it already. Very well. Get on with it! Yeah, that is why I don't try. No, oh, you'll regret that girl. Regret it dearly. So she's been running from the and him. Come back. Come back. Come back. She's got a different way of attack. Different way of uh, fighting. Fair. 
Lovely, that's a new one for me. So Basically, it's good because they just keep spawning. to be stealthy but she makes so much noise jumping down. You tried to kill her, tried to butcher her like an animal and eat her. Her blood, the taste brought back the memories of our youth. Elder blood. Extraordinary girl, but you knew that. Such a shame she fled. I'll find her and come back for you. At least I'll let you get away with it. Uh. She escaped you, but I'll find her. We'll come back here together and kill you. Your return, you shall. Our fates are bound. And one will die. But it shan't be one of us. Now you shall chase shadows and wander midst fog. Each time you see her, she will be a mirage. And if you find her, if the girl will die, you see you, handsome knight. I'm starting to wish I could, uh, could have killed uh, them immediately. Because it sounds like they're going to be an issue. Okay, time to go to the to the Baron, and there was a waves point here, uh, it's north. So, at least we can finish up Family Matters then. So all the way, over to here. So it looks like it was a good call. Not to trust the... Uh, um, let's just get for Roach. Because... Because uh, the, it's quite a bit of a trip inside. Uh, where's all the guards? So at least they, uh, there's still life in here. There's nobody on the beginning of the bridge. So 
So the Baron's wife gave herself to the, uh, to the crowns, the witches. Um, the daughter escaped. What do you do? Ask a bear to dance. Um, no walls. We've got that. Uh, to take it off uh, horse blinders or saddle it's just saddle for saddle just saddle to receive bonuses oh, okay so it needs to be on Saddle. So that's for bonuses. Okay. In Dan One, when a wench takes ill, they send her to the woods for healing, where beasts devour her. Pam, Graham. So to the Baron again. Tell him what happened to Anna, his wife. She's currently as Lunius. Too bad. <laughs> but yeah. I'm listening. What do you come to me with? <sighs> know where your wife is. Got news of your wife. Plowing hell. Why did you not say so forthwith? Where is she? Why have you not returned with her? She's in Crookback Bog. Got food, a place to live, and keeps herself busy. Didn't look like she had the slightest desire to leave. You were to bring her back, not report on the condition she lives under. I was supposed to find her, and I did. That was our deal, nothing more. You still think me rotten to the core. A base bastard, don't you? You believe I alone am at fault for what happened here? Aren't you? Drank yourself into a stupid, abused your wife, drive them out. But that doesn't matter. Doesn't matter what I believe. Yet, looking at you, I see contempt. Can't speak for the world you witches inhabit, but in ours, nothing is ever black and white. Um, to tell me how it is, it was with you, really. Probably gonna say you're not the only one to blame. All right then, I'm willing to hear your side of the story. With Annie, it was love at first sight. A spear tore through my shoulder at the Battle of Anchor. She tended to my wound. Once I'd recovered, I asked her to marry me. She wept with joy. Soon after, Tamara was born. And after that, they sent me to Sidaris. A warlord had risen against King Athen, and Faltest sent help. It was one battle to the next, one conflict after another. It was a life of war. I was seldom home, and I found comfort in drink. Grew so fond of hooch, I couldn't part with it when I did get home. So you became a drunkard. Uh, I want to go, so you're your fault after all. What happened then? All right. What then? I went from front to front, battle to battle, collecting soldiers' coin, while Anna sat alone with the babe for months. Later, I learned she'd not been so alone after all. For nearly three years, she'd found comfort in the arms of one Evan, a childhood friend, a dog's bunghole. 
Understand, damn it. One tussle in the hay I'd have waved aside, put it out of my mind. But the woman cuckolded me for years without a whisker of concern for me, for my love. How'd you find out? Came home one day and Anna was gone. Her things too. Found a letter. She wrote that she didn't love me. That she'd left me for that knob liquor and taken Tamara with her. Felt like I'd been rammed in the ass by a horse. I went to find the bugger. To get the girls back. Bring them home. Yet soon as I saw him, something turned inside me, something dark. I slaughtered the shit-eating twat and fed his carcass to the dogs. Um. Guess they call you the Bloody Baron for a reason after all. What? Your nickname makes sense now. No, no, that's an entirely different story. What did Anna say? Imagine Anna wasn't exactly pleased. Ha! Bloody understatement if I've ever heard one. She flew into a fit. Hysteria. Threw herself at me, kicking and clawing. Finally grabbed a knife. It would have been the end of me if I'd not leapt aside. It was the first time I hit her. I had to calm her. Felt I had no other means. Things changed. They would never be the same. Anna tried to take her own life and mine several times. Couldn't uh, doubt that. She would prod me, goad me, taunt me in the hope I would hit her again, perhaps. She'd scream that I'd robbed her a life of love. But I destroyed the idea for her, and so I might as well kill her. How many times I apologized. How many armfuls of blooms and gifts I brought. She cared not a bit. Two years of her anger had turned to indifference. Broken at times were her bouts of hysteria, and my bouts of drunkenness. Cannot fathom how we survived those years. But we did. And as you know now, not everything was as it might have seemed. Well, you was at fault, um, sort of. Uh, but leaning more towards since you deserve each other. Hear all that much about this. Mm, let's go for three. Don't know why you're telling me all this. Your relationship with your wife, your concern, not mine. Ah, the Witcher. Should have expected as much. Very well then. If you won't bring Anna home, you might at least tell me how she landed in that blasted swamp. Looks like it. Level seven, eh? I was level 4. Okay. Uh, she may add a pack with the current. Wife is with the current. Uh, seems more like a storyline there. Before we go for Your the other wife one. is with the crones as their servant. What the fuck do you mean? What crones? Ones who live in Crookback Bog. Oh, I've heard folk speak of them. I thought it naught but tales to scare the children with. How on earth did she land there? Would be scared if they saw them. A friend captured her. I don't think so. She made a pact with the crones. She made a pact with the crones and... Well, I think she might have lost her mind. A pact? What the bloody hell? She was with child. A child she didn't want to bear. Went to the crones for help. They promised to rid her of the problem in exchange for a year of her service. And they kept their word, in their own twisted way. What do you mean? Anna must have thought the child inside her would somehow disappear. Instead, the crone sapped her of strength, 
and ultimately forced her body to miscarry. I think that's when she started to lose her mind. Then they placed magic tethers on her, tethers that cause great pain when tested. A guarantee she'll pay off her debt. A pact with witches? Bloody nightmare, sounds like some jest. We must get her out. We can't leave her there. I wouldn't recommend it, uh, venturing into that swamp. Uh. Venturing into the swamp, even with armed men, is just a bad idea. It's a dangerous place inherently, and I think those crones are a greater threat than anyone realizes. I'll not sit on my ass waiting for them to return her. Would you wait? Count on their mercy if they had your daughter? Probably not, but I'm a witcher. And I'm a husband and a father who's fucked up his life and the lives of his loved ones. I'll gather my men. Go there and retrieve Anna. I would to wind up here. You got a deal. Time to fulfill your end. I think she's not going to have a lot of men left if they go into that swamp. We but had a deal. I've done my part. Your turn to do yours. A word once given. Now what did I last? Basilisk. It had just attacked you. Ah, right. Gargantuan. One solid brute. I thought we breathed our last. Watch out! If I don't survive this, you're to take whatever you want from the forces. You'll survive! Let's show this bastard what we're worth! Oh, lovely. Where is it? The problem is, is green. So I blend in with the wood. Okay. Get to the top of the tower to rescue Damn the it. Baron. I can't leave him like that. So we need to get up there. Okay. So how do we get past this wagon that's parked here in the middle? Weirdly parked. to go up here.
You have everything? Yes, thank you. What you did for me, I, I shall never forget it. Where are you in? You helped me as well. When your man brought me here. You fed me, cared for me, had my wounds looked after. We're even now. You needn't leave. You're in good company here. We'll always have a warm corner for you. I must leave. Wraiths pursue me. The wild hunt. I was foolish to use the power. They're sure to have caught my scent. The wild hunt? Pursuing you? I'll endanger all of you by remaining here. You must tell the people to bar their doors and windows. And no one is to wander the night. And you? Where do you think you're going? Now, I ride for Novigrad. And then, who knows where. So Novigrad. She mounted and rode off. It grew awfully empty without her. How did Siri get past the Redian block? The Redanian blockade? armies blocked the Pontar crossing, yet you sent Siri to Novigrad. She was looking for a sorceress, and all of them are in Novigrad. Besides, I didn't leave her at the Redanians' mercy. I gave her a letter of safe conduct. Who was the letter to? No one. It was like this one. Show that to those pricks at the crossing and they'll let you pass. This for me? See no reason to make things harder for you. You seek your child, this letter will help. Where did you get these letters? Where do you get these letters? Haven't always led this pack of jesters. Served in the Temerian army once. Redanians guard the crossing. True. But with a bit of fame and a friend here and there, well, banners and heraldry don't mean so much. <laughs> Gotta go to Novigrad. So there's a chance Ciri's still in Novigrad. Thanks for helping her. It's nothing. Now you've learned what you wanted to know, you must be in a hurry. But, if you could... Spit it out. I want to go get Anna. Free her. Bring her back. I don't believe she's there willingly. Must have not heard me. Any journey into the swamp is suicide. I heard you. Which is why I could use your aid. I've no more tales of Siri to offer you. But go with me and I'll be generous with what I do have. Very generous. Hmm. Choices. Problem is with tight on the time. But we need to level up also. So if we go after the witches, we might be able to level up a bit. And then uh, go after Siri. And those witches might be an issue. So, but we can skip all some missions. So let's take that one. Mm. Extra coin never hurt. Ha! True indeed. I'll round up my men and ride to Down Warren. You can join us there. Fine. Sounds good. Tell me, man or monster? My men call him Uma and say he's a beast, but he seems a man to me, just hideous as idle shit. Where'd you get the name? Uma? Strange name. Aye, strange, but he gave us no other. You mean he can talk? Hardly. It was like this. I asked what they called him. He sat there, not saying a thing, trying to stick a toe up his nose. So I grabbed his hand, looked him in the eyes, and asked, What's your name? Gave me this damned foolish look and stammered, Oh, 
Uma? And it's stuck. Doesn't look like a monster. Hmm. Doesn't look like a monster, but my medallion's trembling. Strange. Where'd you find him? Funny story, actually. I won him in a game of cards. Funny story. How so? I went to Novigrad once to rest, indulge in the city's pleasures. Stayed at a tavern and some folk they were playing, so I joined in. The cards were kind that day. Had one devilish hand after another. Robbed the horses blind. One fellow, a merchant, took it especially hard. He'd gambled away everything he'd brought from Skellige. Wanted terribly to play another hand, so I agreed. Asked him what he had to wager, and he showed me that sideshow. Not much in it for me, but fuck it, I thought. I'll give the man a chance to win something back. Luck was not with him. And Uma wound up here at Crow's Perch. End of story. Hi, uh, you've got a gold jester. Proper baron now. Even got a jester. Aye. Now I feel something's not right with him. How so? Well, he seems more beast than man. But there's wisdom, cunning in the bastard's eyes. Or maybe I'm imagining it. Never run into anything like him. No, but he doesn't look dangerous. Hmm. I guess that's that. Doesn't eat much, so as long as he's no trouble, the boys might as well have some diversion. Time I was on my way. So long. Farewell. I hope you find your daughter. And prove a good father to her. Well, he's his uh, adopted father from her, correctly. So that's one thing that I like about ESO is it'll show you all the missions that you've got on the map. Yeah, it only shows you, oh, you need to go there. Nothing about missions that you've got on the map or not on the map. Um, That's level 10. Uh, secondary quest. Uh, invitation by. So I think I need to start looking at these and do the lower ones that I've collected. So let's do it that way around. So talk to Kira. So that would be down here. There's no fast travel point except down here. And where is Roach? I don't see him there, just now, now, comes from there. Let's 
quickly go to Kira. He raised tribute for him. Play host to him. Not one of the barons, then, are you? Quite the work, my man's got, eh? Not half bad. Brought him a back of the sea. Got their asses whipped like an Elvin Rad whore. You surprised? They tried to dance with a witcher. Where'd he come from, anyway? Well, how should I know? Okay. You so Crop off travel left. Uh, okay. So we want to go down here, and this is the closest uh, travel point. And then we need to call Raj again. And on to full gallop. The again. rats, why did he need them? Lady rodents? Better to have stopped them with a poison or crushed them into a pulp with a shovel, but no. Did you see what he did with them? Okay, so apparently we need to talk in it. Okay. Kira, what are you doing? Geralt, <laughs> you gave me quite a start. But nay, the mage, he says, bring me rats and healthy ones. Not something the cat drags in. This the lamp from the elf's hideout? And what's this about rats? Nothing important. I'll explain later. Now, tell me, to what do I owe the pleasure? What do you want, the magic lamp? like to buy something what are you doing okay so just one that we can actually go for mentioned you wanted something from me I did and still do the cursed isle on Lake Windama you've heard of it I'm sure the local peasants mumble incessantly about it about the wraiths that haunt it they claim none who go there return how did it come to be cursed that's what I don't know I must break this spell, yet I've been unable to identify its source. I've got to know something. Scraps. The curse is somehow linked to the tower where Serard, the lord of these lands, took refuge when Nilfgaard invaded. Claims in the village are that peasants, desperate of hunger, sailed to Fike Isle to beg for food. Met their end there. It was a massacre. So, will you please help me lift this curse? You're so good at these things. <laughs> Sweet talk will get you anyway. I'll help. Um, what do you want to lift the curse? All the peasants killed. Uh, All right, I'll help. I knew you'd find it irresistible. Naturally, you'll need to sail to Fike Isle. Fine. What then? Well, the spirits who wander the Isle, you must establish a rapport with them. Don't know how. But they could point us in the direction of the curse's source. Think they'll be willing to chat? Of course. Provided you take my magic lamp with you. I shall let you keep it afterwards in appreciation. You'll find it quite useful, I'm sure. Mm. Now we've got a magic lamp. If only it grants wishes. Uh, why won't you go with me? Can't you just come with me? I tried to go to Fike Isle once. Thought my head would burst, the curse's magic was so strong. Nice of you to send me there. I experienced an acute nasal hemorrhage. You stand to endure a wobble of your medallion at most. At Aratusa, they trained me to detect even the subtlest magic pulses. This was like getting smacked across my haunches with a grain flail. Funny. Thought you'd go in for that sort of thing. Take my boat. I left it on the lake shore near the village. Should be fit to use, provided rot hasn't eaten it. 
as it seems to eat everything here. Much clamp. How it How's the lamp actually work? I mean, do I just rub it or do I have to do something um, magical? <laughs> you needn't even rub. Just place it where you find bones and hear whispers. Um, I suppose I should warn you. It might not be the most pleasant experience. Figured as much. Tell you all about it later. Maybe skip the drastic bits. You'll need to do neither. I'll give you a Xenobox. It's a bauble that will let us speak over some distance. You will tell me what you see, and I shall tell you what to do and look for. Oh, lovely. So we've got a two-way radio. Xenovox, never heard of it. Never heard of a Xenovox. It works just like a megascope, but is far more portable. Think of it as a magic box that talks. Are they hard to build? Extremely. That's why they're so rare. I certainly couldn't build anything like it. So no chance these Xenovoxes will catch on with every mage using one? Not the slightest. I'm off to... to get to... Oh. I need to know anything else before I go? No, that is all. Okay. Oh, go already. I can't wait to see what you discover on Phi Kyle. Just be sure to come and see me afterwards. And... Geralt. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay, new item required. A quick slot to use. Okay. So, one of two. Okay. Trissa's house. Um, that's not where we want to go. The sky is about to reach Fake the old curse, yeah, that's the one we wanted to do. So it basically took me directly to the main quest. Again, um, okay, so we need to get the boat here, and I'm assuming this is where we need to go. Come Roach. What is this thing doing? I'm looking at the map thing and it's jumping all over the show. I cannot do that, I want to get in. Okay. Take helm. And side sail. A very simplistic way of the, that this thing is working. Don't need to worry about setting the actual sails and stuff like that. Just, just point in a direction you want to sail in, and it'll sail in that direction. But can't take damage also. Geralt, can you hear me? How close is it? Where are you? Almost there. Splendid. I shall contact you again soon. Wait, this Xenobox. Can I contact you with it or is it one way? One way only, I'm afraid. You'll have to trust my feminine intuition. Your what? My feminine intuition. Wonderful. So she can contact us, but we can't contact her. 
lovely. Sounds like the perfect solution. Literally taking the boat to the monsters. Safe right now. I'm safe. Okay. For me, and there also. Some monster blood. And I'm keeping to the side. Because I don't want to wear out my weapons too quickly um, so there's one and there's one I'm going to have to fight I'm not going to have a choice Monsters. This one was so close to the coast I couldn't go around that side. There's a lot of monsters around here. This barricade going on. And we've got a fast travel point. Lovely. So let's just save that. There's a lot in here. We need to go in there, apparently. Okay. Lots of rats. Peasants didn't come here to ask nicely. And that's probably why they put us killed. Let's try Kira's land. So, did I say? Yeah. Oh, I need to...
Where's that noble? Lying here, quiet as a man. Okay. Where? Rich folk. Doubt I'll ever understand them. Keeping rats in cages like rabbits. Let them out, maybe. Like to die of hunger if we leave them there. I'd sooner burn the vermin. Releasing them's not like to bring no good. Imagine the harm they'd do if they swam back to the village. Swam? Rats? How do you figure they'd do that? Actually, can. You needn't fret for them. Clever little bastards. Clever in you. Hmm. They seem sluggish to you. Got the mange, maybe? Oh, and that stench! Okay. Place is full of rats, as many dead as alive. Think they're feeding on. Work, Geralt, stop. We need to be busy. Why not? What do you want to deny everything? Okay, it shows here the lamp that we've shown. Here's something else. Blood. Many must have died here. And here's something to look also. Very sold. Okay, nothing else down here that I can see. Where's that noble? Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pump. So we've found this. Where's that noble? Lying here, quiet as a mouse. Head split open like a rotted pumpkin. More like a peasant now. Sloshing around in his own blood and shite. Be nothing noble about him. So Too noble, quick to nobleman got killed there. That's upstairs. Don't start, Annabelle. Back to your craft. Always bending my ear about fool peasants. I'll not hear of them again. That simpleton turned your head. But one Graham hardly makes the rest courtly, one and all. My lord, peasants, they're through the door in the tower. So they were basically attacked by peasants. Who we'll slammed the door? like that's the woman. Seems to be running from us. Where are you? Have you got to the laboratory at the top of the tower yet? I'm at the top. Nothing here that looks like a laboratory. Then you've not reached the highest level. Look for a passage. Hmm. Someone dragged something across the floor. Or dragged it from one wall to the other repeatedly. 
Like a laboratory. Pretty well equipped, too. Why did you leave? You claim to love me. I'm cold. Why has no one come for me? I cannot leave this place. I see no way out. Who are you? Do you seek to hurt me as well? No need to fear me. Don't be afraid. I want to lift the curse that grips this island. Your turn to tell me who you are. The other ghosts, they couldn't see me. I'm special. Always was. The rare beauty. The Lord's daughter. These lands, as far as the eye can see, were ours. My family and I, we hid in the Mage's Tower to await the war's end, the end of hard times. It was not to be forever. The Mage of the Tower, who was he? Mage who lived here. Who was he? Alexander. I hardly knew him. He spent most of his time locked away in this tower. He's dead too, you know. They're all dead. Mountains of corpses, yet I stand here alone, all alone. They've all abandoned me. Even he who promised me everlasting love. You will abandon me as well. If I can lift the curse, you yourself will be free to leave. What happened in the town? Tell me what happened here. Peasants sailed to the island to ask for food. Is that true? No. They came to rob and kill. They thought us rich. Believe we'd stowed ourselves away here to laugh at their misery. Yet we had little food as well. Too little to share with those who came. They slaughtered everyone. I heard my father cry out, but the mage told me not to reveal myself or let anyone in. He gave me a potion. If I was discovered, I was to drink it. He said everything would be all right. The potion, what was it? What kind of potion was it? Remember its smell, what it looked like? I remember only that I feared to drink it. Didn't trust the mage? In the village, they claimed he meddled in disease, not curing it, but causing it. They said he lured rats into the tower, infected them with the Catriona. Only rumors, surely, but I was afraid. So horribly afraid. And then I heard him, my beloved Graham. He called to me. I opened the door for him, but others rushed in. They lunged at me and... and Did they hurt you? They gripped my arms, tore at my dress. I managed to free myself and drink the potion, and then... nothing. Poisoned? That how you died? No. For I later awoke. I was alone, it was dark. Only there were rats. Everywhere. Dozens. Hundreds. And I... Couldn't move. Sleeping potion. Effects hadn't worn off yet. You were paralyzed. They were everywhere. All over me like insects. My face, my hands. I felt them rip open my skin, then crawl into my stomach. 
cool way to die. They tore me apart, and I could not even scream. Have I not suffered enough? Why can't I leave this place? Um, can you talk to the other souls? Can you talk to the island's other specters? No, I'm alone here. The others, they flee when they see me. I know not why. You do not fear me, do you? No. Used to dealing with ghosts. Though, gotta admit, there's something about you. You're different. How can I help? How can I help you? A curse born of hatred binds me to this place. Only love's power can hope to lift it. But who could love a race? And your beloved, he dead too? Grail. No, he lives. I would know if he died. But he fled and abandoned me. Left me here all alone. Maybe you could strip the curse of its power by forgiving him. You might cleanse the isle. Graham, tell me about him. Your beloved. Who is he? A noble son? No, a poor fisherman. My father objected strongly. He did not see us together. I miss him so. Each night I walk to the island shore to gaze upon the village. Does he remember me still? Hmm. Said before you can't leave the tower. Did I? You must have misheard. I don't think so. I... I don't know anymore. It's all a nightmare to me. The curse is focused on you. As I see it, you're the curse's focus. The other ghosts on the island, their auras aren't nearly as strong as yours. My medallion started pulsating as soon as we started talking. I don't know what you mean, but you do seem to know some things. You could be right. My fate is tied to the isle, I feel that. Perhaps because I am heiress of these lands. It could be your blood ties to the land, the base of the curse, that is. If so, forgiving Graham, laying your resentment to rest should lift it. I loved him. I'm prepared to forgive him. But I must know that he regrets what he did. Take my bones to him. He must bury them. This will be our farewell. Will you speak to him? Will you do this for me? Fine. I'll talk to Graham. Where will I find him? He lives in the village on the lakeshore, yet... What if he's forgotten me? If he loved you, he'll remember, and want to help. He said he would always love me. Go to him. Make haste, please. Or will we wait to die? Experimenting on humans. Never would have gotten away with it if the Conclave were still in charge. Unfortunately, that's always a possibility. So what's up here? I have to look around for salute. Kept in there until the end. What a shitty way to die. Uh, not what I wanted to do. I can't see what's here. Oh. Other people. Okay. 
So basically, we need to go down and then take the um, fast traveling point to go to town and get the plants buried. By the one that she uh, basically left. So down another stairs. So I've got another f formula. still around. Nothing else here, so we can leave. Are we now one level to... Oh, we can deeper this is where we came in so let's quickly do this and then get out of here As I remember, there was a, a what do I call it, a signpost just outside the city. And there was a monster there. Back to the signpost. So we need to fast travel now to. Oh, lovely. We can't fast travel. Fastest way is to get to the sh boat and go across. question is how much resistance are we going to run into? Apparently not a lot. So this must have been uh, uh, one of the peasants uh, what the? Get up! Get into the boat. Yeah. And we just ride a few. There's what, four or five of them there? It's not looking so well either.
can't do that now. I can't climb up, apparently. So, look. I want to talk. You dead I told you. Who are you? Been to uh, Fika Island. I've been to the island. I know what happened there. What do you want of me? I'm here about Annabelle. Want to talk to you about Annabelle? Annabelle? What can you know about her? I met her. Talked to her. Annabelle's dead. Drank poison. And I... I couldn't save her. She didn't drink poison. Fuck her island. What, what happened on Fike Isle? You gotta tell me. It's where Millie, Finch and Faulkner, they rallied the men, all roughs, to go to the isle, take back what was ours from the noble. They knew I was known at the tower, that the Lord's servants would open the gate for me since I sold them fish. They forced you to go with them? No, I... I saw my chance in it. For Annabelle and me to flee. But... It all spun in a chaos. Our boys from the village, they started killing everyone. Annabelle, they wanted to rape! Of course, then she drank the poison. Mage must have gave it her. I ran out the tower hollering that I wanted to die, cursing them all to hell. Don't force me to speak of it. No more, please. It wasn't uh, poison Annabelle took. It wasn't poison. Annabelle drank a strong sleeping potion. Mage wanted to protect her, make it look like she was dead. Convinced everyone. But that means... Is she... You said you spoke to her. Spoke to her ghost. By the time she awoke, tower was full of cold corpses. And rats. She was warm meat. Rats ate her alive. You mean... She was alive the whole time? But... I can't be. She was cold all through like a corpse. I shook her, begged her, open your eyes. I never thought... You can still help, Annabelle. Annabelle needs you. Her soul will only find peace if you help her. But what can I do? It's too late. Bury her bones. Annabelle should be laid to rest by one who loved her. It's the only way to lift the curse that holds Fike Isle. There is a... Her bones? Yes. Give them here. And leave me be. Leave me be, or prevent me from going out the door. Good idea. So, tell Kira he lifted this curse. So, Kira. Went all the way over here. Where my horse is. And I've unlocked that uh, fast travel point. So I just need to go basically ah! up here. <laughs> what was that sound? She's free. Oh, she came and took him. A girl and plated flowers. Looks like a small shrine. Apparently, be a daughter. Right, yeah. On to the wave point. Let's 
signpost. So here's the signpost, so we can fast travel all the way over to here. And then we can get right. Getting stuck by the water. Really right. I'm scary, I think you know. Let's cut through the wood. And I need to meditate somewhere along the line. But there shouldn't be any creatures or anything here. But apparently there's wolves. And I just ran through a whole pack of them. Come now. Here's the house. Baron's henchman. Uh, how did I arrive from there to there? I must. Just <sighs> Let's just meditate and heal up. Apparently I can't uh, follow pointers. Let's try this again. So the yellow pointer should be where we need to go to. Come on, Roach. And in we go. starting to miss you. <laughs> I always look good uh, to be missed. I managed to remove the curse. Fike Isle's free of its curse. And you withheld this news until now? Why? I gave you a Xenovox. But the curse, what was its source? The dark spell clung to the spirit of Annabelle, the Lord's daughter. To free her and the Isle, Graham, her beloved, had to help me. So it ended well. Mm. I lifted the curse, so the island's clear. Annabelle's soul is free. Thing is, turned out she's a pesta. Graham's dead. And you fail to notice? You're losing your touch. Be that as it may, Fike Isle is free of its curse. That's important. I'm almost inclined to say good work. I don't know was doing some strange research. One thing's bothering me. What? Annabelle said Alexander was studying diseases. She mentioned Catriona. You knew this? All the mages knew about it. Alexander was a highly regarded epidemiologist. I would have given anything for an opportunity to study his notes. 
but he guarded them jealously. What do you want to do with the lamp? The lamp? What do you want to do with it? As I said, you may keep it. I don't believe I shall need it anymore, given the aisle's been cleansed. I actually regret not going there with you. Perhaps we can make up for that lost time now. Okay, so what do you mean by that? But okay. All right. Time I was on my way. Perhaps, perhaps you'd stay just a bit longer. There's one small favor you might yet do for me. What is it? I put in an order for a few substances from Novigrad. The trader was due to be here yesterday, but has yet to arrive. Could you see what happened? The package is rather important to me. Fine, I'll look into it. Why not? If he was coming here from Novigrad, he must have passed through Blackbell. I'll check the area. Thank you. I shall be ever so grateful. Okay. So we've got another small mission to do. Ask a service of the Witcher, the Pelamost. A witcherly service, that's to say. What do you need? Tell me. A man who fears no evil, the Pella needs. Forefather's Eve is nigh. We've rites to conduct. Wandering souls to emerge. Damned souls, too. We've the circle to protect from these wretches. Okay. Doesn't really... For the Father's Eve, what's the point? Why hold the ritual at all? At times men die choking with regret. At times death takes them before they've tasted any bitterness in life. These poor souls, unfulfilled, cannot leave this veil of tears. Their spirits wander midst the living, must be judged, sent on their way. This we do on Forefather's Eve. So, in other words, if we don't help, they'll stick around. Seems like you could use a witcher, so yeah, I'll help. You'd not refuse, the Pell on you. The time's come to gather the folk. Across the lake we must journey, to Fike Isle. There in the circle of stones we shall meet. The sooner we resolve this, the better. Best do it tonight, at midnight. So back to Falk uh, Isle. Let me guess, it gave me the... Oh, not that one. Uh, it gave me the... Uh, the uh, primary quest again. So, favor for a friend. Uh, and f farm islands. So. So, these are the two things that we have to do. So, yeah, next one to do is favor for a friend. But for now, I'm going to have to call it there. And let's see, who we're going to. Right. With my broken system, apparently, um, and I'll have to troubleshoot wh uh, why some of the stuff is not working. So let's go write somebody that I've actually watched quite a bit, uh, and which is actually a, a nice person to also uh, watch. Currently playing um, some VR chat. So thanks for everybody who that watched. Until next time. If I can find the right buttons.
because now my stuff is not working correctly.